stopping the news at this time. The effects of a slowed economy continues to be experienced globally. What measures are being implemented to improve the economy? And are we solely dependent on an increase in energy prices to facilitate the recovery from the current economic situation? What is government doing to protect its citizens? While Minister in the Ministry of Finance, Senator Alison Best, attempted to answer these and other questions as she discussed government's platform for financial growth in 2018. The Alpatis reports. Response to the downturn in the economy being experienced globally, government has significantly reduced expenditure and is all about accounting for all they spend. That's the assertion made by Minister in the Ministry of Finance, Alison Best. She says in keeping with its mandate to hold organizations accountable, government is seeking to have the accounts from each of these bodies brought before Parliament. There was a significant backlog, but we're clearing that up. And as and when the Parliament decides that things should be examined before joint select committees, they go and we are happy to be there to answer any questions. So we are all about accountability. In response to a release from AMCHAM, which states that collaboration is needed between government and the opposition for Trinidad and Tobago to move forward, Ms. Bess said cooperation is in fact necessary. However, she says it's often easier said than done. If you would look at the, at the, at the difference between our operation when we were in opposition, you would see that we agreed to about 95% of the bills that were brought by the opposition. We have been having difficulty getting the same kind of support and there are critical bits of legislation that do require the opposition support. So we're hoping with more dialogue and a more reasonable approach that we can get the support. We need to move Trinidad and Tobago forward. Asked to expound on comments by Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley that we are beginning to see the light at the end of the tunnel, she said an increase in energy prices and the prudence of government are contributing factors to the country's improving financial situation. The strict review and attention to expenditure, keeping that expenditure down because as you know we would have reduced the national expenditure by about $10 billion in the last couple of years and we are really keeping a tight control on that and the measures that we are putting in place to simulate the economy, I think the combination of things is what has us heading in the right direction. Ms. Bess said government continues to work assiduously to improve Trinidad and Tobago's current economic situation. Dion Batiste, C News.